What's going on guys and welcome back to the most spectacular read through of all times. I am the big cliche. I am big uh, Papa Pump without the pump. I am the rock that is never hard. King Kong got a lot on me. I am T B R Terabyte Reacts, and I would just like to say, you're welcome. Welcome back, guys, to another episode or read through, I should say, of Berserk. We're gonna be doing volume 11 today, even though we might not get through the whole thing. Uh, I'm telling you guys right now, probably not gonna get through the whole thing. Okay, I got like an hour to do as much as possible as I can. So, um, looking at, let's go over to the other page real quick. Let's go over to where, we, where I'm going to do the read through. Okay, so what I'm going to do is this. I'm going to finish this, finish this up at the end of the week. So you guys are going to have this maybe Wednesday morning. I would say Wednesday morning, maybe late Tuesday night. This might be ready for Patreon. Um, and then I might put this out later in the day for Wednesday or some or something of the sort. I don't know. But I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get through this entire volume. But I'm going at the end of the week on Saturday, I'm going to finish up, finish this volume up. Okay, so. Um, so I might get to like the fifth chapter, maybe six chapters. We'll see how things go. Cause you know, m maybe I'm talking in between and I might get to that one hour before I get to those fifth and sixth chapters, but we'll see how it goes. I'm pretty sure we'll get through these devil dogs chapters, but I also see some mortal combat in there. You know what I'm saying? Okay. <laughs> Let's get busy with this reading, man. Let's just get to it. Um, but before we jump in, we know what's going on. Griffith is being, um, has been rescued. We're sad, <laughs> okay? But, um, you know, there's some subtleties there that happen, you know what I'm saying, um, with Griffith and Guts that I'm, I'm looking forward to see what's going to be the dynamic. You know what I'm saying? And I, I'm paying attention gonna be paying attention real close so devil dogs i don't know who those guys are but let's go see what the meaning of this is let's just get to it okay so we got castle 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 devil dogs chapter one so we got the pervert king over here thinking about charlotte of course charlotte she hasn't spoken a word to me this past year in fact she shut herself in a room and I haven't even seen her. When I said that I was entering, she screamed and cries as if she's gone mad, like she had been cornered by some dreadful monster. Because you are a monster, you piece of shit. He was like, thank you, father. What? Uh-huh. What? Father, hey, I imprisoned her beloved man, mad with jealousy. What's more, I committed a... Even as she bravely risked the poison in her own body, I committed a deed lower than even a devil's, the devil's against her, my own daughter, yet she calls me father. And he's like, I won't forgive you. I'm betty talking about Griffith. Griffith, your words would stole Charlotte away. You alone, I swear it, for that I would despise even this thing, that man, I'm sure that, we all will bring your head before me. Who the hell is we all? It was five years ago when I decided that in order to compensate for the shortage of soldiers in the prolonged war, I would assemble all the able-bodied criminals of the kingdom. Of all the collected convicts, one man volunteered. He was a bizarre man. Something about him was inhuman. Wait a second. This is Nosferatu. It's Nosferatu, isn't it? Is it not? I didn't even recognize this dude. It's not, isn't this Nosferatu? If 
if I'm not being mistaken, is this not Nesferatu? Is it not? I guess it's a different guy. <laughs> I'm just it just looks like him. I'm not gonna lie, it just it just kind of looks like him, but it's a different guy. I, I'm just remembering the timeline now. It's got to be a different guy because they look similar. Okay, so you wish me to make you you wish me to make you the leader? Yeah, the way we do things, the strongest takes charge. Say what? The hell you think you are? You want to get beat down, monkey? This is the guy that we saw having sex with all them women um before. This same dude that looks weird. Okay, so Barbo. It's Barbo the 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 harmer hack hacker hacker. <laughs> Um, I like your style, monkey. Shrite, shrite, the toughest gets to be the boss. And that's me. So, so an octopus slipped into the monkey troop? Hey, king, let me have a go with him. Whoever win gets to be the boss. Cool? Majesty. The king says, very well. It is the only way to settle it amongst them. So this was five years ago. Okay, so we're getting to see the guy that we saw at the end of the last volume. Having sex with all those women we get to see is kind of how he came to be under the king's command. Because he wants to go head to head with Griffith. With, he wanted to go after Griffith at some point, I think. Um, if I remember correctly. So, it was obvious to anyone where the strength lay. The man who first stepped forward had but a slight chance of winning. On the other hand, the giant Barbo seemed easier to manage. Thus, I permitted the duel. Hmm, hmm. So they let them both out of their chains or whatever. I don't need it. No sword either. It's all in fun. So this guy decided he not coming out of the handcuffs. He gonna take this dude with a handicap. Okay, you need some kind of performance to capture the hearts of the troops? To get ruffians like these to obey, sometimes ordinary incentives won't cut it. Overwhelming power, a sense of charisma is essential. Chariz what? It's like, and he looks to the king again, he says, King, as thanks for my appointment as leader, I present a goodie to you, a new statue on the top of that tower. And this dude pulls out the hammer and was like, enough of that silly nonsense talking out of you. Eat this, you monkey. And he goes off to try to hit, hit the dude. Whoa. He went apeshit. Bruh. Yo, how? I need to see if you hit him. Bro, this is not okay. That is the new, the new statue I was talking about. Bruh, it was like, it was an unbelievable spectacle. In an instant, a strange statue had appeared on the peak of the tower. Although it had happened before, our eyes, it still seemed as if it had been unreal. Like some tasteless joke or something. Not one man there was able to emit even a sound. As he declared, he completely seized the hearts of the convicts through a charisma of fear. The Black Dog Knights, he led, the Black Dog Knights he led were on Equal footing with the band of the hawk in terms of valor, but even with that in mind, their inhuman cruelty was intolerable. Whether they were in enemy territory or my own domain, or my own domain, as long as it was a battlefield, they would plunder, violate women, and butcher even the old and children. Wow. So that's why everybody was pleading to him, don't use them. Okay. At least we get that understanding. Okay. But instead of finding fault in them during the war, I would send them to remote battlefields to keep him away from the center of my army, from my presence. Yes, I was afraid of him too, that strange man. Maybe 
he isn't even human yet all the more it's fitting for the hawk's windpipe to be gnawed through by an evil beast beyond human control just you wait griffith the hounds have been loosed starved for blood the black hounds of hell okay easy easy okay so this is guts and them now trying to bring guts is like there we're sorry to burden you on top of watching our horses you're loaning us a cart here's what we promised this much is more than enough believe me being able to help out the lord griffith the kingdom's hero and the band of the hawk the honors all ours um please take these so you have some people offering them flowers and stuff it's like i believe in you so what they're saying at the castle must be some kind of mistake i know that none of you would ever commit treason i believe i believe that we all do sis got all dressed up oh hush you okay so we got some people here that's getting them some horses and carts. It's like, we entreat you not to tell anyone about this. It would end up putting all of you in danger as well. Like, we know. All right. You sit back there. Watch over Griffith so he doesn't fall. So Jado tells Casca to stay with Griffith. Ah, it's like, I can't find words when there's so much I want you to hear. Right, let's go. And you know Guts is watching her because this there's a it's a weird triangle, but I do I do believe that Casca loves Guts. I do believe that she loves him. And so and and it's reciprocated. It's very requited love. But there's still the issue of Griffith where this this does this unusual bond that she has with him. You know what I'm saying? So there's that to contend with. No, I don't really know if it's contention per se, but it's definitely there's there's something there that Guts is watching because it's like, I don't like this. It's uncomfortable. <laughs> okay. So they take off. It's like, this isn't the time to be saying idle things, but this might really be our last glimpse of that city. A lot's happened when you think about it. Okay. Somebody's blowing up my phone, but we're here. Okay, so there's flowers. Now it's all so distant. Whoa, whoa. Hi there. Oh, snap. This dude is here already. He's like, might I inquire something of you, girly? Did a suspicious group with a wounded man pass by here? She starts shaking. Like, hmm. Before the hawk hunt. Guess I'll get the juices flowing a bit. Yo. These dudes don't play. They killed all of them. Raped the girl. He's like, it's my motto. Make it fun. Make it stimulating. My guy. Is this really necessary? Ugh, pursuit. Isn't that bruh? Yo, these guys have no chill. These guys have no chill, dude. Bro, look at these dudes. Skewered. All right, let's get it. No, how could they? The Black Dog Knights, an army unit drafted from criminals. They're the most rough shot in all Midland. I'd heard in the war they were so bad they were sent to the frontier. But this is even worse than the rumors. 
First assassins, now a bunch of thugs? Looks like we're really on the king's bad side. This isn't normal for a single jailbird. Shudo, we should see the bridge soon. Fly, says Casca. It's like, like you had to tell me, I'm out of here. Like, <laughs> it's like, I see it. But with so little distance between us, we can't use that trap. Not good. Guts. Guts jumps. Did he come out? He's like, it's like, I'll buy you some time. Go. No, don't be absurd again. Like you were that time. It's like, don't worry. I learned something fighting those hundred men. If thing turns ugly, I'll run. Okay. So she's kind of smiling, I guess. Now where it's like, now then. <laughs> Yo. Guts is out here, man. Band of the Ark. Power tab. Power tab? Is that what he said? Power tab? <laughs> I don't know. Power tab tag whatever okay so he goes after them chopping off heads seems like pippin is there with him too okay good pippin is there they're taking them out boom bada boom they're coming bang bang heads flying let's go all right it's like what's with these guys they don't back down no matter how many we kill they just keep coming. It's like, it ain't normal. Their eyes. It's fear. They're being driven on by freaking fear. It's like, move. This dude coming through. So somebody s sends a body at him. He sees a head flying towards him. That's crazy. So big dog comes out, huh? So he's like, so Guts is still on his horse. He's like, ain't we a lively one? Let me play some too. This guy's a freaking beast. Anyways. He's like, Shh. so Guts replies. He's like, sure. I'll play with you. And he slash it at it. If this guy catches this sword, I'm done. If he catches the sword in the next panel, he, oh, he didn't catch it, but he held his hand. He, and Guts is like, what? Oh, now that's one big toy. So what did you do now? Guts is shocked. Shit, I'm shocked that he, that he caught his hand. It's like, dude, this dude is a monster, bro. So he's holding on to Guts' hand and the sword, and Guts is like, I'm getting crushed. Pippin comes in to Slash. Did he miss? He's like, yeek. <laughs> A tag team? That sounds like fun, too. And Guts is like, what is he? It's like, no one's ever stopped my sword beer handed before. And with one hand, too? And this bloodthirst, it ain't normal. He reminds me so much of, of Nosferatu. It's like, I know this. I remember this, this feeling. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like, it's the same. Yep. It's the same. It's like, guts. Come on. Oh. She calls him. They get it's like, wait up. So they took off. And he's like, it's it's all right. Don't be scared. So they blow they it's like gunpowder. <laughs> Fun. So they basically blow blows up the bridge. And they're like, hurry. So they're gonna blow up the bridge. Okay, so that's the end of chapter two. This is crazy. This is crazy because at least that guy is a freaking monster. And it's the same feeling he felt when he went up against Nosferatu. And I I can totally understand. He's like, wow, don't stop. Just keep going. Okay, so they're taking off. The bridge exploded. How are they going to catch up? He's like, safe. So I, so I say, 
but a lot of them sure fell. Oh well. <laughs> Come on, you dogs. Let's go. He's like, hmm, what's wrong with you guys? Is the deer like, this, this, this is crazy, boss. He's like, why? It's a straight road next to a mountain. If they knew their escape route from the start, they'll have laid more traps like this one along the way. And he's like, your point? We ain't especially scared of nothing, but it seems stupid to dive right into the enemy's hands. So he reaches over with two fingers. Bruh, did this nigga just crush this dude's head with, with two fingers? Is that what I'm just, is that, is this? Is that what I'm seeing right now? Did he just crush this guy's head with two fingers? What? Uh, he's like, oh, please. That's the problem with grown-ups. What? Bruh, this dude, what is he? He's like, if you start talking about living and dying, you end up wasting your life away. The creed of the Black Dawn Knights. To enjoy and excite. Damn right. Don't you forget it. <laughs> it's like, here comes the pooch patrol after all. It ain't just some simple pooch. I'm sure of it. He's the same. Bruh. It's like, but why? Why do things like that keep appearing just appearing to just me and Griffith? One year hence shall be the time of the eclipse. Yeah, he's remembering what he what he said to him. When his ambition collapses, death will pay you a visit. A debt you can never escape. It can't be. Right? It's like, we're here. The next point. He feels that hand reaching over him. He's like, ah. So he's reaching out. More traps. <laughs> Kill it. This man don't give a shit how many men he lose. He's just like, to excite, baby. <laughs> He's like, to the club. <laughs> like, oh, <laughs> it's like, oh, nice sound. <laughs> Music to my ears. Big pinch. Yahoo. <laughs> this guy is ridiculous. He keeps riding on. It looked like his horse got hit in the head, didn't he? Damn. This dude is punching rocks like it's nothing. Punching boulders. Just keep 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 running through traps. They keep going. What is this now? Another another explosion? Yep, another explosion. And he just he just he just killing off everybody. He's like, I can do this guy myself. It doesn't matter. None of this affects me. I'm out here in these streets, you know what I'm saying? What you got? I could take it. <laughs> like, so they're asking, is he a monster? Yeah, I think so. It's like, no good. It ain't even slowing him. I guess we're going to have to face him again. Costco says, no, we just barely made it. They're shooting arrows over there. No, who are these people? Oh, the rest of the band. Okay. I thought they all got killed. What the hell? Hold on, Kamuska? Didn't they all get killed? What is going on? Okay, so we got some people here. What was Kamuska not among them that was left? I'm pretty sure there was. It's like, so he's like, <laughs> he holds his hands up. He's like, hmm, I've always wanted to do this. All right, listen, you louts. All forces charge to the front. For hold up wait strike that once more <laughs> they didn't even wait on him to finish so they're charging charging they're like now this finally feels like a battle the much rumored band of the hawk time to get me the full taste of them and guts comes down to him he's like i'll be your opponent i don't know what the hell you guys are but i'm taking care of you personally monster Okay, you got guts versus this dude. <laughs> it's like, who, buddy? 
You act like you know something. I don't know why I'm over here moving the entire window. <laughs> you know, that was weird. <laughs> Anyways, who? Buddy, you act like you know something. That stupid cow, Zod, said there was a lively one in the... Oh, so he does know the nigga, man. They must... Are they family members? Maybe this is his brother or something? And he's like... And he said, that must be you. He's like, no mistake. I knew it. Looks like this will be an unexpected festival. Because I told you, man, the guy reminds me of Nesferatu. That's why I was like, is, this ne is it Nesferatu? It's not him. It's not Nesferatu. It's somebody that knows him. But it, it seems like they're off the same family or something, man. So he's like, now, let's play. He's like, a death you can never escape. So is he, so is he what that's about? So he's remembering what Nosferatu said to him. He's like, it's like what a load of crap. Who do you think you are? Who the hell do you think you are? So Guts rushes in. And they're calling out to him. Guts is in this battle with this guy. And they're like, Raiders, don't fall behind the captain. Go slay them. This just don't get old. <laughs> It was like, I'm counting on you with Griffith. Just leave him to us, sis. He said, they took Griffith out. Casca jumps on the horse. It's like, let's go. So they went back to help. So for now, anyways, we've got to get through this fight. So you got Guts versus this guy. That we don't know what his name is. <laughs> um. So... Guts goes after him. They clash swords or whatever. Clashing swords. Speed. We got heads and hands getting cut off. It's like, get back. You'll get dragged in. That's the same as a tornado. Amazing. Raiders Captain Guts. He's back in full force. He's even more awesome than before. He definitely is awesome. That's sword handling beyond imagination but that man is easily following guts movements this guy's incredible he's stopping my sword with a goddamn log <laughs> he's like and his movements ain't even technique they're sloppy he's doing it all by pure reflex but i ain't about to let him parry like that forever so guts This man is unbeatable, bro. If he's anything like 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 Nasratu, bruh, this dude just catch a sword in in his teeth. He, he just caught he, he just casually did that shit. Like, no, nah, not a big deal. You know what I'm saying? I do this all day, every day. You know what I'm saying? All day, every day. Just you know, I practice this shit at home. You know what I'm saying? Just putting a <laughs> sword in my mouth. You know what I'm saying? It's like. Show clush. <laughs> Show clush. He caught it, bro. He caught it in his mouth. Did he? What did he do? He punched the horse. My guy, he punched the horse, bro. Guts jumps off. Kicks him in the face. Kicks him in the face. Looks like he kicks him off the horse, too. Cool. Guts lands on his feet. So does he. He's like, those two are unbelievable. I've never seen a fight like this. It's like, always stealing the damn spotlight. Come on, you need to get over yourself. Like, for real. You, you should be over yourself by now. It's like, no way. He's like, he caught a sword with his teeth, and it was Guts' armor-crushing sword. If he can do something like that, he's the real deal. He's a monster, delectable, 
You are just too tasty. I never thought you'd make this so enjoyable. It's like, what the hell do you eat with those teeth? You know what I'm saying? He's like, this was... This was only meant to be a light snack. But I can't quit. I might just eat everything. I won't wait till the eclipse. I wonder what he's talking about, the eclipse. He says, like, just a little longer... The enemy won't find us here easily. Y'all need to give this man something to eat, like for real. Okay. So he reaches for the sword. Why is he reaching for a sword? But he can't even do that. Because he can barely lift his arm. Look at him. He look. He's so tiny. Okay, so Guts and the monster going head to head. Whatever his name is. All right. Roar of the wild beast. Okay. So the enemy's in a rout. Finish them off in one go. Okay, so they're all here fighting. It's like, B -b boss, it's no use. Everyone's running off on their own. These guys are just too tough. He's like, w w what? But the festival was just getting started. Sheesh, my dogs give up way too easy. So they're like, so he, this guy is not about to pick up a tree, grab a tree like it's nothing, bro. So he punches the tree, bruh, he kills all of his guys, he killed all of them, he killed all of his guys, he's like, yo, y'all are too weak, bruh, he's like, hey, did he just... Yeah. <laughs> All right. We're going to take a break here. Come back for another part. Okay. Let's get back in. It's like, hey, did he just. Yes, he did. He's like, ah, oh, don't I always tell you the fun starts now. You've got to think about life positively. Ah, uh, no more. No enjoy or excite. I don't want to die. And he kills you. <laughs> He's like, that's why you guys can only die in piddly ways. What's with that freak? He starts, he started on his own man. He's like, hmm, hmm, that sure spoiled the mood. Nothing for it. So now I will start this party myself. He go, yo, he took off all of his armor. This is a. He took off all, what in the bananas? This guy has an eye in the middle of his chest. What the hell is going on? What is, the, what in the bejesus? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What is this? This guy has a high in the middle of his, his chest area, middle torso. What, the, what is this teeth? Is this teeth down here? What, what is, bruh. Yo, I'm pretty sure they didn't see nothing like this. Bruh, this guy is a, he's out here in these streets. He's like, yo. So Guts is standing there. He must be trembling, dude. He's like, I was right. He's just what I imagined. Bruh, what is that, bro? Oh my God! Is they're like, ha? Huh, is that? Z? He's like, no, it's not. It's something else. They they all think it's Zod because they they remember Zod. It's like, boss, Griffith, are you all right? This guy just picks up a tree like it's nothing. All right, all righty then. Let's give it a go. Damn, he about to swing the tree at Guts. Bruh, is Guts gonna get out of this? Alive? The hell? Bruh, did he jump? What happened? Guts gets, he gets hit. He got hit, bro. Shit. So 
It's crazy, man. This is nuts. They're like, ah, oh, big sis. Wow. They're going at it. They're going at it. So we have Costco laying on the ground now. She fell off her damn horse right in front of them. It's like, just when I thought this party was a sausage fest, a cute girly shows up. And he tries to grab her, like, may I have this dance, miss? They're like, hmm? He reaches down. What happened? Oh, they they, sh they shot at him. They're like, sure enough, didn't work, just like with Zod. Quit complaining. Second volley, I think I know what's coming. It's like, geez, talk about uncouth. Being bothered while I'm slaying or laying. <laughs> Pisses me off the most. Oh, man, this dude. How are they going to beat this guy? Because he's not like Zod. Zod not going to fly away and give them prophecy. This dude is, he's a, a sadist by every means of the word. Okay, my My horse. Wow. This dude is still out here. This pummeling dude with, with the tree. He's just hitting dudes with the tree. Look at these guys eating dudes. Bruh. This dude is going off right now. He's just chomping dudes like it's nothing. Uh, like, retreat, retreat. Everybody run. This is no longer a battle. Damn it. Why? It always us. Why? Why? We've always got to fight those things. We're screwed here too. Hey, bring a wagon. Right. So Costco went to go get Guts. He's like, Guts, get up. It's like looking at him like smacked him across the face. It's like, open your eyes. You want to be stomped to death? I won't let you, not here, not by that outrageous monster. Weren't you going to take me with you? Weren't you going to take me with you? Weren't you going to take... Mm, you better grab him and go. Damn, bro. So he's like, sorry for the wait, honey. And reaches for Casca again and grabbed her. And Griffith is there. Griffith sees what's happening. And she's crushing, he's crushing Casca. Is like, uh oh, whoops! Now that I finally got you, I got a little excited. At this size, it's like playing with a doll. Now let's get you undressed. Shh. Now let's get you undressy, undressy, whatever, undressy, whatever that is. Look at that, cause she's in trouble, Griffith. She tears off Casca's armor. That like, armor don't look good on a woman. But personally, I'm not one for dresses either. Rips her dress. Jeez. Yep, women look best with nothing on. He's about to eat her. The bottom one won't quite work here. So here's what you'll get. Bro, what kind of hentai? What? Bruh! He is not about to violate Casca like this. It's like, I'll soon make you forget about all your past men. Somebody needs to do something. Bruh, what? She's like, no. This is not happening, right? Yes! Stab him in the dick. Or whatever that thing is. So Guts gets up. Stabs him just in time. He's like, don't go swinging that filthy thing over my head. He's like, not my 
<laughs> what is this? Oh my god. Why did they not let him say it? <laughs> yes. Okay, so he grabs Casca's leg. No, he cuts he cuts his arm. Guts takes the arm. Cuts the arm that he was holding Casca in. And it's like she's there. <laughs> Girl, get your clothes on, because everybody can see what's happening back here right now. <laughs> like, come on. Come on now. <laughs> Just like, damn, slapped me enough, busted my lip, gave Frico here a run for his money. It's like, but thanks to you, I'm back up to this. Okay. So, Mr. Monster over here, he's mad. It's like, look over there, Captain Guts. It's like, so he's all right. That fool. You don't mean he's going to fight that. But that's insane. One hit from that thing can take out dozens of men. It's a monster. It's like, clear off, Casca. You'll distract me looking like that. It's like, hey, I'm taking him one-on-one. One-on-one. Let's, come on. Come on, Guts. And Casca cries out, what the hell are you talking about? Forget it. Let's get out of here. And he's like, just get moving. Screams at her. It's like, no matter what, I've got to settle the score with him. With them. By my own sword. It's like, okay. like I feel it way down in my gut just it's goddamn war cries about to blow me away it's like will it work really will my sword really work on this monster move come on body forward so he steps in going after him it's like move your ass forward mortal Kombat chapter one it's like guts so he goes after him he moves out of the way out of him trying to grab him boom to the mouth let's go let's go guts let's get it he gets in there it gets in there stabs him in the mouth now he's trying to rip it open he swings out rips it out that's what i like to see that's what i like to see let's go huh He's going after him, man. He's like, oh. You on the ground, big boy. You on the ground. Guts is like, it's working. He's like, oh. Looks like he can do it, the fool. Awesome. So he goes in for the kill. Guts jumps in, looks like he's going in for the kill. Stabs him in the belly. Or whatever. In the dick, it seems. It's like, got him. No, oh, no. He got held. What the hell? What did he hold him with his foot? With his feet? And they're like, Griffin is looking. Like, who is this guy? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So he grabs Guts again and throws him. Throws him. Out here looking like a big-ass gorilla. He throws him. Guts spits up blood. Oh, hell no, nah, this guy did not jump. It's like, why? When I've chopped him up so much why is he this dude is jumping bruh he's in the air he jumps over his leg and, and we all stomp it's like is this pos is this impossible and we all backfist so this guy has names for his moves is he we all is that his name because I've, I've seen it before 
um before but i didn't think it was his actual name but i guess i was just stupid so i guess we all this is his name so we all the back fist he's hitting guts right and he's like wait a sec did he just die from that so Casca is there just like hey that ain't good did he just buy it it's impossible no human can beat that thing So Griffith is here. Look like he's biting his tongue. They're like Griffith. It's like, is this winnable? And he's like, you are gonna die. So his sword is where? Where is this? What is this? Oh, flashback maybe. It's like, hey, you're gonna die if you keep doing this. You'll really die someday. You broke a bone again. Oh yeah. Say. Why do you do these silly things if it's sword practice? Do you have to go this far? He's like, I don't like it. I mean, it looks like it hurts. I'm not, I'm not sure why, says Guts. He's like, but the one who beat me wasn't like this. He was more. He's like, was he human? Hmm, maybe not quite. He's like, a monster? I guess something like that. Right, Guts, do you want to fight with him again he looks at the slow is like I don't know it's like you shouldn't the monster will beat you so he's like then you can win can't say he's like which is it it's like hey bruh guts is out here like hanging from the branch of a tree just out here and he jumps up again he gets up again with a slash and slashes the eye. This eye. I wonder if those eyes are significant. So he slashes one of the eyes. And Casca is still out here. Shirtless. <laughs> you know. So he got one of the eyes and he's looking up like, ha ha. So he like, so he's like, did that work? And he tries to smash Guts with his fist. And he takes another, he takes a finger now. Cool. Guts is not giving up. So he's like, he's like, why you little? And he's like, I get it. That does it. You're dead meat. Says, I can't remember his name. <laughs> Riard, Riard, Beyond, Beyond. I don't remember his name. <laughs> that does it you're dead meat I don't know what he gets I guess maybe he gotta get take the eyes out so Guts gets up is like well let's see about that and that's the end of the chapter it's like I'm in deep I can hardly stand some crack ribs too looks like i can't move much anymore what now it's like what do i do what do i have to do to win i don't know either buddy i thought you said you get it <laughs> you know but anyways like give it up going over there won't accomplish anything let's go you know he's like let go you know because she because he's trying to grab her to take her back it's like at this rate at this rate, he's, and he says, if you go now, you'll only hinder him. Look at his eyes. He hasn't given up. He still wants to kill. And she's like, why? Why does he always have to fight? It's all right to just run away sometimes. So Guts is standing there and... Ria, whatever his name is, like Neal, or whatever. You little prick. Can I take it? <laughs> Guts is wondering if he can take it. It's like, that really hurt, asshole. <laughs> so he's try he's really trying to kill Guts right now. I can't do it. He's getting pissed off. So Guts is there. And he gets, he got hit back. He gathers himself. Is like, my sword. Anymore, and I'm really screwed. 
one more hit like that and I can't fight. I've got to find an opening. And he looks at the, the dead guy beside him. Why? Like, so dude is out here looking for him. He's like, hey, where'd you go? If you're alive, answer. I haven't been hurt this bad in 100 years. So I got a little carried away. Come out, come out, wherever you are. I'll be a little more careful of killing you. <laughs> Like I got, uh, and Guts is thinking, I got one chance. Neither my sword nor body will take more than that. He's like, he's like, why aren't we just precious? Because he saw Guts behind the tree. Or maybe it's, it's a trap. Oh, it's a trap. Okay. So the body that he looked at, he hung it up behind the tree to make it look like he was there right so the, so he sees it thinks it's guts okay i'm following it's like yeah we uh, his name is we yalled not this is the wild chop so he chops the tree down thinking he, he got guts right so guts he, now you got an opening he's like that was a pretty good plan though and trust and thrust, not trust. And thrust. <laughs> so you went after guts, thinking it's guts again. What happened here? Is he gonna notice that it's one of his guys? Here comes Johnny. <laughs> I'm sorry. So, um, so he hits it, thinks it's guts, and here comes guts now, flying out of the sky. What is he going for the head, right? He's like, what? Nani? <laughs> Here comes Guts flying out of the sky. He took off his armor. He, he smashed Guts' armor, or Guts took off his armor. He thought it was him. Um, So he puts his hand up to block it, but his Guts went, sword went through his hand. And he's screaming. And the art is amazing right now. And he go <laughs> Got him! <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! I'm on your head! <laughs> I'm on your head, bruh. I'm on your head. Bruh. Bruh. He got him in the in the head, in the main head, too. Right through the brain. He grabs him. He puts his hand around his neck and starts to choke him. And he pulls out another knife. Bruh. Guts looks like a savage right now. He pulls out another knife. Pulls out another knife. Hit him in the in oh stabs him in the eye. Bruh. Stabs him in the eye. He got hit. He got hit. No, oh, he got slammed into the tree behind him. He got slammed into the tree. So he fell off of him. And this dude is still standing like, yo, what? It's like bleeding. Ooh. Oh, he fell over. Ah. Oh. Bruh. He fell over. Kas Kaska jumps over, drops her sword. Bruh. Went to go look at Guts she's crying. He's okay. Gives her the thumbs up. <laughs> Gives her the thumbs up. Everybody rushes in. She hugs him. Yeah. Armor of the heart. Okay, guys. That is where I'm going to stop today. That was awesome. That was off the chain. 
Um, t I'll finish up this volume. Um, I'll finish up this volume um, on the weekend for sure. So you guys look out for that, of course. Um, but thank you guys so much for tuning in, man. Um, so I will see you guys for the review when it comes out on YouTube, whenever. And then we'll, I'll finish up this um, volume. How many chapters do we have left? Armor to the Heart. There's probably around four left, right? Because I did a lot. I think I did. I did a lot, man. It's probably like tr three chapters left, but I do not have the time. Because this manga gets me too excited. Right? It gets me really excited. So let's go back to the top real quick. I want to see how many chapters I did. We're at Armor of the Heart. Damn, it's only three left. I wonder if I could knock it out, man. Let me see if I can knock it out, guys. Because I have a few minutes. Let's see how it goes. I might I might have to quiet down a bit. But let's see how it goes. You know what I mean? Let's see how it goes. Now I lost the entire thing. You know what I'm saying? I think I can search for the page somewhere. I was like at 137 or something like that. Ah, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. 137. Right. Let me scroll from the bottom. Let me not look because I don't want to be spoiled. Uh, looking at the page numbers. Cause I don't want to be spoiled. Uh, no. Come on, come on. Page numbers. Uh, what chapter is that? Oh. I'm trying to scroll as fast as possible because I don't want to be spoiled. Come on, man. Uh, trying to look at the page numbers and not the page. Trying to block my vision. All right. Uh, come on. Trying to block my vision. Just looking at the page numbers here, man. Okay, that's not where we at. Uh, I think I'm there. Yes. All right, so we're back to somewhere. I think our wheels are like 170 something, right? Okay, so he's okay. All right. So we at Armor of the Heart. We're just gonna knock out these three chapters. See if I can finish up this volume. Um, I didn't think uh, these chapters were actually very short, to be honest. Okay, so we're back at the the palace with Charlotte waking up. She's like, where am I? Your Highness. Chambers. Your Highness. Cha Your Highness's chambers. It's like, Anna. Thank goodness. Oh, really? For a time there, I wasn't sure. If the worst had happened to you, I would have been hanged. It's like, Lord Griffith, tell me, is he safe? It's like, yes, more than half a day has passed since then, but it seems that no report of Lord Griffith and the others being captured has reached the castle. She's like, truly? She's like, oh, thank goodness. Then his majesty kept his promise. I shall call the head court lady and court, um, court lady and court physician. It's like, Anna, I caused you grief. I spoke so selfishly. I'm sorry. It's like no, it's it's all right. I can't tell her that the band of the hawk is still being pursued. Yeah, you can. It's like I'm sure it's what Lord Griffith said to me. What did he say to you? That he would come back. I promise I'll return. A bird. What is that? That's not no bird. <laughs> it's freaking Nosferatu's <laughs> flying around like it's a regular day in the sun. Anyway, so um, Casca is stitching up guts. As like, be quiet. I'll I'll mess up. That hurts. I'm crying here. It's like you disregarded orders and charged it off. You reap what you sow. 
Like, talk about severe. Ain't you really the boss? Because everyone's so scared of you, like the Black Dog Knights. I'm trying to be serious. <laughs> she pulls it. He's <laughs> like, sure, you're much stronger than you were one year ago. You've improved several degrees beyond anyone in the in the Hawks. But as always, you don't know when to quit. Only knowing how to swing a sword, how to fight, that's still just the old you. This isn't child's play. There's no shame in retreating. If you wind up dead, then it's all over. You've got to start exercising your head a little too. I wouldn't be a mercenary if I weren't ready to die. Damn, I get lectured for winning. <laughs> it's like, fine then. Die on your own. She's grand. She's just, she's just worried about you, bro. You get what I'm saying? She's just worried about you. It's the thing, you know what I'm saying? So, that's all that is. It's like, there you go. As soon as the wounded are seen to, we'll set out to meet Rickard and the others. Rickard and them is dead. Okay, I thought, I didn't know that Comisco wasn't with Rickard them, but apparently he wasn't. So, you two get some rest. It's like, Griffith. It's like, welcome home. So, how is he, you know? I'm no doctor, you know, so as for details, she's like, please. It's like, the tendons in his arms and legs are ruined. So things like standing or holding a sword are impossible. She walks off. It's like, everyone hurry. We have to cross the border sometime tonight. So we cross the border. After that, then what do we do? It's like, look at it, really wild. It looks like it could swallow a beer whole. What in the world is this monster? Like, I'd know. I don't want to think about it either. It's bad luck. It's like, but wow. Raiders Captain Guts beat even this thing? He ain't human anymore either. Giant Monster Showdown. First Captain Guts came back and now Boss Griffith? Yeah, now it's really the band of the Hawk Revival. Thank God after this past year. Thank God after this past year. So, hmm. It's like, what's up now? Nah, must be my imagination. It's like, ow. It'd be nice if she'd learned how to sew. <laughs> it's like... Is that we must look like a couple of tattered rags by now. Well, at least we get to sleep while they carry us around. I've been swinging my sword non-stop since yesterday. It's just like that time. That time with Nosferatu Zod. Both of us busted up. But we both survived. Ain't it hot? That mask? It's okay to take it off. No one's here but us. Is that like, hmm? Huh? You want to wear that? The armor? <laughs> uh, like, ow. It's like, yeah, that sounds like you. You ain't changed at all this past year. Alrighty. It's like, that mask will do in place of a helmet. There. Nice fit. This little battleground, after all, gotta wear armor on the battle. Gotta wear armor on the field of battle, or you're good as dead. They like best friends, man. This is just awesome to see them. All right, so we got. What's going on here? The guts flowing out, or whatever. Wait a second. Did is this dude waking up? Did he eat these guys or something? Bruh, he's not dead. Is that don't want to, hey, you just say something? Bruh, he's not dead. He's like, I don't want to die. He's like, there we go. So he's putting Griffith in armor for some reason. He's like, the white hawk flies again. 
and he tries to pull out his sword but he can't but he's like I know you're in a rush but you're not ready yet I mean it's been a year since you've even worn armor soon you'll be able to swing that all you want soon and they're like enemy raid it's like no way yo this guy is relentless knocks guts out of the 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 cart bruh is like no i don't want to die it's like not like you die easy you stubborn bastard like guts griffith you okay it's like there you are damn did he just you're like griffith dude he grabbed griffith and it's like you son of a don't move if you do damn it ah, stop it it's like stand down griffith damn it damn it what the hell is he just like some insect but what the hell is he just like some insect but i he's hurting i'm screwed no time left if i wind up dead here i'll be inside that vortex forever what vortex they're like hey hurry and summon them the great ones who the hell are you talking to bro is he talking to griffith he's like the great ones if you're really going to become what one of the greats like zod says you should have it the crimson the crimson beheal it the egg of the king use it call them our guardian angels the four members of the god hand oh, shit so this dude had an agenda for getting griffith in the first place so he so 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 nasferatu zod must have told him hey this guy is supposed to be the the leader is like in time at that place this is crazy it's like god is like that's enough they try to shout it's like release griffith there's no way you can win now it's like you people uh -huh. what's so funny freak every last one of you's got a twinkle in his eye i can't stand it they ain't the eyes of those who fight for a living they're like the eyes of a kid who's had his toy taken away i get it he's what does it he's the precious kid's toy you guys must be so happy you don't know a damn thing your precious toy was broken a long time ago so So he rips off the the armor off of Griffith. He's like, look. Look at this mangled body. Yeah, we know he needs to eat. It's like he gave a year's worth of playtime to that perverted, perverted jailer in the Tower of Rebirth. And it ain't just some skin he's missing. His arm muscles look at this these tendons gone bro leg muscles and tongue they've all been cut up or cut out i bet you planned to carry him up and make something of yourselves again too bad it'll never happen he can't do battle anymore or ride a horse or wield a sword hell he can't even stand up on his own you're lucky if he can crawl around like a bug he can't live on his own the rest of his life. None of you got any hope. Not even a sliver. Damn. Guts is getting mad. He's like, whoa, don't move. I still have enough strength to pluck his head off. Mm. It's like, now, while the atmosphere is still nice and hopeless, better hurry before I can't see anymore. Hmm. So he's looking for the behelit. 
It's like, where's the behelet? He doesn't have it anymore. He's like, that can't be. You're supposed to have it. It can't. You, you, you're kidding. If that's not here, I. If it's not here, what? I, 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 this is what they do when they're desperate. Because we've learned this before with um, the other guy. When they're desperate, that's they, they, that's what they do. They need the God hand. For, for, you know what I'm saying? Like They need to summon the God hand so they can survive. Um, so we got the immortal once again. So it's like, so here he is. It's like, you're kidding. If that's not here, I... Bruh, what happened? Did he jump down? Yes, he jumped down. This is Nosferatu. And he's like, this is, we said, why are you, bruh? Did he just kill him? I think he just killed him. Bruh. He did something. Bruh. He's like, he's here. It's the real thing. Zod. Nosferatu Zod. So he grabs Griffith. He's like, Zod, what do you think you're doing? He's like, is this on their orders? No, that can't be. Do what thou wilt. That's the only commandment for us apostles. Even if I ring him to death right here, no one should have any reason to complain. Even if he is the fifth one. The fifth one. He's like, fifth one? What's he talking about? He's like, that's right. And if I rip you open here and now, that too is my free will. He's like, ow, wait, stop, stop. You and me are on the same side. It's wrong. It's not him. He don't got it on him. He's like, he don't he don't got the behelet. He ain't the man we think he is. He's like, then either way, there's a chance of you. There's no chance of you surviving. Bruh. Nasratu said, you, you dead either way. And then he throws Griffith at Guts. Guts catches him. He's like, are you all right? What is the plan here, man? Now I'm a little confused. So Nesferatu stand there, look at him. He's like, it will return to your hand. Because that's how it is. So he's telling him he's going to get back to Behelit. So it's like, wait. They're telling him to wait. He's like, I've got something to ask you. What the hell's the eclipse? Ain't it this monkey monster thing? Is like, that death you said I wouldn't be able to escape? Wasn't that him? He's like, you will understand soon. He's like, hey. And he flies off again. Uh, like big sis look yeah this always happens like it's like they come to collect it's like what's that it's like tearing it up no it's being dragged in from the inside this is crazy Yep. It's like it it's gone. What did we just see? Hey, look here. What's this? We all no way. <gasps> but what else can it? It's like this was that monster's true form. No way. It's like this 
little old man that the immortal once again it's the end okay so we got through the volume not much there at the end but I mean not much was left for me to do so I just finished it up I didn't think I would get through it to be honest but I gotta be a little bit quiet right now because I told you guys but anyways man thank you guys so much for tuning in I'm gonna be doing the review but as you know it's only gonna be on YouTube so you guys don't get to see it too bad <laughs> anyways um I could do the I, I I want you guys to, to that watch on um on Patreon to actually go to YouTube to see the review. So if you could do that, that would be much appreciated. Um that's why I don't do the reviews here on these videos. Um so I would love if you guys go over there and keep the support over there too if you want to see the review. I know I know it's it's a lot to ask. You get what I'm saying? Because you're already here. I should just do the review here. Or you could have a choice to go see it over there. Whatever the situation is. But I just want you guys to keep the support over there. Because we do need to keep up viewership over there. Over on YouTube. So thank you guys so much for tuning in here. Thank you guys so much. I will see you guys for the review. Alright. So Berserk. Berserk. Whew. Berserk. Berserk. <laughs> volume 11. Beastly, beastly, beastly volume, man. Like, I love this one. Definitely love it. Um, I'm still going to try to do another one coming up this weekend. Um, this was surprisingly short, to be honest. It took me, what, an hour, maybe an hour and a half to do this. Um, about 11 chapters. So I'm not mad at it at all. These chapters were were really short, um, compared to what we've seen in the in the past. So we got through it pretty quickly. Uh, but it was awesome, man. But I, I, man, they just keep laying, building the world, and I love that because now there's this thing going on now, um, where he's supposed to be the fifth, right? Griffith is supposed to be the fifth. Which is something we got an inclination of. We know eventually he ends up with the God Hand. We know that because we've seen how things happen before. Now we, this is like a a, um, a prequel to to what we've already saw in the beginning of him coming in contact with Griffith and the God Hand. So we know Griffith eventually ends up with the God Hand. You know, but to see how it unfolds is just so fascinating, man. And to see Guts go up against Weald or whatever his name is, Weald, Weald, right? To see him go up against them and to actually damage him in, in that kind of way was kind of like the beginning, official beginning of Guts showing Guts really true his power. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's just not afraid. And he's no special power. This is, he doesn't have the mark, so I can't even say the mark give him some kind of power or whatever the situation is, because this is all before the mark, and he's, like, going up against, like, a formidable foe, so I definitely give him props for that, man, that was an incredible fight, him showing guts, you know, saving Costco from being raped, I felt like I was watching some sort of anti-tentacle shit for, <laughs> for a minute there, you know what I mean, so that was, that was not something I was going I didn't want to see that because that would just be so traumatic because she's been in a, not the greatest position before. I think she's been raped before, right? I think. So that wouldn't have been cool for her to do that. And then for it to happen in front of everybody, that would not have been cool at all. I don't put it. I, I still don't. I, I, I didn't. It's something that is would have been possible to happen in this manga you know what I'm saying? Because this author and this writer and this artist does not pull any punches when it comes on to writing this beautiful story. So um, if it happened, it wouldn't have been out of the scope for, <laughs> for me to think that it couldn't happen in this world. We've seen everything. You know what I'm saying? Molestation. We've seen, um, you know, um, guts. 
You know what I'm saying? We we've seen guts getting molested. We've seen um Charlotte by his dad by her dad. You know what I'm saying? Like it it's been it, it's a tough road. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's a tough road, man. This manga does not pull punches, and I love it. I love the fact that he's the way how it's being written is is raw. It's raw. It's raw human emotion makes you get more involved in the world, and I love that, man. I love that. Um, so basically, the you know the the entirety of the volume was about that fight about guts versus we all we all versus the the band of the hawk what's left of them they still don't know that rickard and them is dead so they're gonna find that out soon enough um griffith not knowing what's happening right now present time you know what i'm saying he's practically useless at this point so i can see him as i said from the last volume that we did when i said that i can see why Griffith chose to do that based on what's happening to him right now. He is literally useless. And if he wants to feel, I'm pretty sure that the magic of whatever they're doing, the demon world, whatever it is, is going to give him back all of that power. You know what I'm saying? Him being able to do stuff, you know what I'm saying? Use his arms, heal him and stuff like that. So he'll choose that knowing that Casca and Guts is hooked up they're you know they're good uh, maybe he feels like left out maybe he feels like he can't be the leader anymore because he's being humiliated so i can see how that could drive a person into the wrong hands so i'm definitely looking forward to see to see what happens in the next chapter them finding out um hopefully in the next volume they find out uh, um the remainder of the band of the heart hawk um kamuska he's back um you know being salty and all um so yeah man Nasferatu Zad showed up again killed Weard or whatever his name is um Weald <laughs> whatever um killed him or finished him off and give them back Griffith and be like yo you can't mess around bro I know for a fact he had it because he saw it he saw that he had it so I don't understand how we all come to this conclusion that, oh, it's not him because he doesn't have it. You got to remember that Nos that Nosferatu Zod saw him with the behelet. He knows that this dude has it, so he's supposed to be the fifth. So you have to believe that 100%. Yeah, he may not have it right now. So I told him, hey, it will return to you. Don't worry about it. Okay, so there's, there's, not, there's much to divulge. There's a lot to divulge in this volume but i don't want to sit here talking forever on this review just know man this was a fire volume and i'm so glad i finished it i'm glad i finished it took the time to finish it i'm trying to talk as low as possible because i don't want to wake up anybody in my house right now uh, but it's awesome man it was it was an awesome volume i enjoyed it very much you guys will see um that you guys must have seen it in my reaction. I enjoyed it very much. It was awesome. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. As always, remember to subscribe, leave a like, and also leave a comment in the comment section, man. We out. Terabyte out.